I'm back in America. I didn't really make an update of my whereabouts, but yeah, I had been in Bali for the past four weeks. My decision to go to Bali was incredibly impulsive and uh, probably most likely fueled by my sixth quarter life crisis. I'm just going through things. I shared a lot here already just about the whole job situation and like what am I gonna do with my life because like I don't wanna go back to corporate. It's a whole thing, I'm figuring it out, but it was really nice to just think about nothing while I was out there. Happy I got to do that, but now we're back, we're back to reality and we need to be an adult. <laughs> I'm at my mom's and I don't plan on being here any longer. I'm gonna leave probably the next couple days. I just have a few things I need to do. One, need to take advantage of the fact that I'm here and just unload all the things I don't need that I thought I needed. Yesterday, I already cut half of the clothes that I had in here. It was a lot of clothes. Some clothes I didn't even realize I had. Now I have other things I need to go through. This is what I'm looking at right now. Someone is swinging by, someone that you know. He's coming by here today and we're going to be living in this van together for about a week. More on that later, but for now, let's get to work. One last thing, I'm sorry. I hate doing like a bunch of talky talk stuff in the beginning of a video because I think it's really annoying. While I was in Bali, I got this really, this really cool tattoo, so. It's really, really itchy right now. All I want to do is just, just gnaw on it. It's so stinking itchy. <sighs> I took like a two hour nap and I don't feel any better. I'm still suffering from jet bag, jet bag. <laughs> I'm still suffering from jet lag. So last night I didn't sleep at all and that's why I'm struggling, okay? So give me a break. Okay, I finished. In the nick of time, check it out. It's nice and tidy in here. I'm gonna have a roommate for the next week. The next week, I'm gonna be living in my van with one other human being and Toby. Of course, Toby. I drove like 50 miles on my low gas light. I don't know how in the world I made it here. We're at 3% here. 3% for a 30 second van tour? Is that 30 second is? van tour, let's go. Welcome to the new van. It's got a subfloor done and that's pretty much it. <laughs> I went to Lowe's today and I bought two two by fours and have them cut and then I bought an air mattress and threw it up here so that I can sleep today in a parking lot. This is my separator from the front to the back. My fuel tank and a lot of fuel parts. Max air fan, and that's, that's pretty much it. She doesn't have much, but it's gonna be really cool when it's done. 30 seconds? I think so. I think you actually won this time. Hmm. Everyone loses the 30 second thing. So. <laughs> yeah. The whole point of it is to witness everyone act like cats in a bathtub. Just the chaos that comes with it. That's yeah. what we like. I haven't seen this guy in two months. Has it been that long? <laughs> it's just been two months. You've been in, you were in Central America for a month-ish and I was in... I was there for five weeks. And then I was in Southeast Asia for four. Yeah, so math. <laughs> so it's been a while and he's moving in with me. That's right. Whether she likes it or not, we gotta uh, we gotta be roommates in the ProMaster for the next <laughs> this thing. I don't know how many days. We have some rules that we need to go over. You know what? I'm actually busy this week. I think I gotta go. <laughs> Look, the only rule I have for you: we were together almost every single day for like a week and a half. You know how I live, so I better not hear sh about my messy van. This is the cleanest I've seen it, to be honest. <laughs> you know it's only gonna last for maybe another hour, and then it's gonna be a wreck. His cute little fridge that he had in oh, his van. Oh no. No way, they're all good. Took a really heavy slam in the ambulance, or not Aww. the ambulance, it's the van. <laughs> and somehow all the eggs are good. It's very soggy, uh, but we got eggs. If you're Almost. I didn't pack an onion. I just, oh, I did pack an onion, but not like he munch on an onion. He packed himself an onion. Is this holes? An episode of holes? I took all I'm the stuff. I'm tired, Grandpa. Is that from holes? Yes. Well, that's too damn bad. Keep digging. Oh, that is. It's from the flashback, huh? <laughs> yeah. No way. I'm tired of this, Grandpa. That's too damn bad! You keep digging! Tell me if you think this is a horrible, horrible idea. Letting me move in? This is, it's a terrible idea, I already know. But we're committed. That is too bright. All right, Brandon, are we both vlogging today? 
Oh, looks like we are. <laughs> What's up, guys? Welcome back to the channel. I'm here with Sarah Shamblin, and I live in her van now. That's right. <laughs> That's not going to be my intro, but it'll be something similar to that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, it is the next day. I picked Brandon up at the shop where he dropped off his van. Then we went back to my mom's house, stayed there, and now we're back at the shop because we're checking up on his van. Because guess what? What? He just bought a van. <laughs> oh, yeah, I bought a van. I'm getting it converted to four-wheel drive and lifted and making it super cool, and I might just resell it for a profit. Or I might sell the ambulance. I live in an ambulance if, if you don't know. But I live in an ambulance and I have converted, blah, blah, blah. And I might sell that and keep the van because I really like the van now, but I don't know. I'm rambling. So anyway, why is he in my van? I just got back from Bali a couple days ago. Coincidentally, he drove up from San Diego with his new van so he can get it converted to 4x4 at the best 4x4 shop in all of the lands. Which is weirdly 10 minutes away from Sarah's house. And I didn't even know she was from this town. He did. I think he did. He just doesn't listen to me. I have a bad memory. Yeah, that's why he's in my van. It doesn't take seven days to drive to San Diego, so why are you in my van for seven days? Actually, that's a good question. Why are you in my van for seven days? Is it seven days? Probably gonna get back around Saturday next week. Yeah, we have this really cool cliff jumping thing where we're trying to light up an entire waterfall at nighttime and jump it for like this big camera production thing that's going on that my friend organized. So it's kind of on the way back south anyways. It also worked out great because Sarah wanted to go back to Southern California anyways, and that's where my ambulance is, so it worked out perfect all around. Look who is FaceTime. Finally, it's Bart! Look. Bart! <laughs> hey, man, what's up? Yo, what's going on? Hey! Say hi to the vlog! Hey, what's up, vlog? <laughs> so Brandon posts daily vlogs, and we're watching it right now in the live chat. Make sure you check out his channel and live chat with us every day. Well, I probably won't be there every day, but... I'll be there. M most days. <laughs> the one time you were on mine when I wasn't there because I was asleep in Bali, that well, yeah, was nice. I was answering all the questions. They're like, where's Sarah? And I'm like, I think she's sleeping right now. <laughs> oh yeah, look at her. Damn, look at those bikes though. And that moped. Oh, I should say that in the chat, huh? <laughs> Are you filming this? Yeah, stuff. <laughs> Did you see Belton Dog? I don't know where this vlog is going. I think it's just a day in the life of what it's gonna be like living in a van with... Sorry, I'm working. I'm posting. No one cares. You don't have to talk. I'm talking. This isn't about you at the moment. Well, kind of is. I live here now. So. <laughs> I just want to talk to this big fuzzy microphone because I don't have one of those. I just want to whisper to it. Whisper to it. Stop it. What's up, guys? Sarah's gonna have to bleep all this out because I'm gonna say... <laughs> Love you guys. <laughs> Boom, just hit, oh. Oh, your favorite song. <laughs> All right, let's go. I'm hungry. Brandon and I are starving, so we stopped by this diner that was kind of nearby the shop. This is how poor we are. We go in there, we look at the menu, see the prices, it's gonna end up costing us like $40. It's like $18 <laughs> for a freaking omelet. That's crazy. So we left. <laughs> and now we're going to Taco Bell. That was my first choice anyway. <laughs> What do you have to say for yourself? That I'm excited for some spicy potato soft tacos. Really excited. Mm. All right, Brandon's gonna start putting the swivel seat into my vehicle and I might help him. I don't, I probably won't. I don't really want to. I gotta pay my dues somehow. <laughs> A musical talent over here. I'm jack of all trades, you know. <laughs> oh, I found a tool. Oh, Milwaukee, okay. Uh, hood, hood, pop it. It's right here. He has never been in a ProMaster, it seems like. So you just like do one of these guys. Oh, shoot, I need a quarter. Do you have a quarter? You need a quarter? I ain't got no, I ain't got none. Hmm. Oh, I guess it can't be done. That's a wrap on this job. No quarter. I'll do all these? Brandon, is that your sock? No. Not my sock. <laughs> what socks? <laughs> he managed to get this unplugged, so now we got no power in the van. We're not gonna get attacked by the airbag. But it took removing the neutral wire, the negative wire. Why did you look at me like said something stupid? Oh, the neutral's a weird way to say that. Tomato potato is what it is. He removed the negative wire because there's like five different positive wires there and we would have had to remove all of them to make sure we got the air bug. Oh, sorry, there's a lot of crumbs on this seat. It's kind of gross. Can you go get a shop back from art? No. All right, look at this. We got Swiveltown up in here. Woo. Thanks, Brandon. 
Of course. Okay, what are we working on now? This drives me crazy that it's just, but it's like one screw. It's all you need this whole time. So Brandon is so nice and so sweet that he watches my vlogs and he watched the van tour one. The van what? The van tour. He makes fun of me for saying tour. Okay, anyway, he watched my van tour vlog and saw this and I was gonna fix it. This works out for me greatly, honestly. <laughs> Damn, no more. <laughs> That's all you needed. Another job done. <laughs> trim it's because the butcher block just like completely annihilated it mm. so what happened is that this totally moves now uh oh we're losing things so when i drove and it did that it completely just took the trim with it and what this didn't work before <laughs> before i had to pull this out first before pulling that out two birds with one stone right there you all right we're gonna have to move this whole area and make room for the trim and butcher block disaster. And now it allows this drawer to work, which didn't work until you opened this before. You know what, I'm starting to think that Sarah should be paying me. I am paying you. With what? Kind words, compliments. Sometimes. A place to stay, perhaps? Okay, that's fair. <laughs> Not hey, using I got this a fucking on your bougie ass? ass bed over there. <laughs> Do you ever want to fall in? Let's play it. If you ever want to fall in love, if you ever want to be I'll be waiting. I won't. I'm fucking wait for nobody. Okay, I cleaned up the space for the man to work. What are you doing? Just looking at all the random things you have. He's so nosy. <laughs> I don't like leaving him alone in my van because I just, every time I walk back in, he's just like looking at something, inspecting literally everything. I get bored and then I just start looking around and I'm like, what is that? <laughs> what is this, a sleeping bag? A sleeping bag, I like to go backpacking. Oh, and your Cotopaxi bag, I have the same thing. Is this a solar lantern? See? Look at this. Oh, an air mattress. <laughs> Unnecessary. This is the guy. This is the guy that judges me. Why do you need a blow up mattress? Just hang out outside. If I saw a girl on a full blow up mattress hanging out outside of her van, I'd be like, that's weird. She has witch fuel. I think she like does spells and stuff with this. I'm just trying to get myself to this one. This is like a <laughs> van judgment video. What's this? Open it. <laughs> oh, you rock climb. I have the same shoes. I got those free. Another camping bag? This is a back, my backpacking bag. The other one was my travel bag. Why? Oh, we should do that tonight. Like this isn't like a Halloween light. mask? No, it's like one of those red light therapy things. Oh, I thought this was like a Halloween mask. <laughs> no. I have a library. Oh, you do have a bibliotheca. What's this? Oops. Oh, that's for traveling. Oh, yeah. To weigh my bag when I travel. You weigh your bag? Sometimes. How often do you go in these boxes? Never. I wish we had cabinets up there. I don't want to do that. Are else. you offering? I do not have the tools for that. We need saws and all kinds of stuff. I don't think the wire on the fridge is long enough to pull the fridge out to get back to put a bracket to hold the countertop down. I can get one in that back corner and I can get one behind the sink, which will be plenty to hold it in place. Yeah, that'll be good. We'll see. This is a necessity. Cue the Home Depot. Dun 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 dun, you know? And then there's like a hammer, like a nail and hammer, like ding in there. More doing. That's the power of the Home Depot. I think that's how it goes, something like that. Can I only wear this? Yes. Not, no pants, no nothing, just this. Put my one tool that I don't even need. Why do you have a mag magnet on here? <laughs> Soap. Because you know you're going to get dirty when you're working at the Home Depot. And then some separation anxiety medicine for whenever I just get so worked up with my tools and my man work. <laughs> Biotin because I want my fingernails to grow fast. And just some daily cleanse. And really, when you have this set up, there's nothing you can't do. Get you can cook a pizza. Oh God. Let's get to work. This is my second one screw fix of the day. I'm gonna put more in, but it's fixed for now. This one, first, you saw it over there, one screw fixed it. And then I put one of these in the back, going straight up, and now I'm not gonna move anymore. So I think I'm gonna clock out for the day. More saving, more doing. That's the power of the Home Depot. Ding! 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 Ding!
burning her in a banjo think the pain of burner. <laughs> <laughs> Brandon, do you want to get fired? Look, the problem right now is that I'm just straight up meat castle of a human, just girth. And I just can't fit in your cabinet with two hands. I need to be able to get my whole upper body in, hold this in and drill it, but I can only get fit one arm and part of my shoulder. You're a smart guy. I think you could figure it out. Why don't you just dislocate your arm? Uh, can you reach in and drill from here over top of me? Or maybe you do this part. Actually, yeah, you do this part. So am I putting my arm in? Yeah. The brackets are doing that. You don't see the bracket? It's like laying in there. <laughs> Alright, put it in. No. Is it in? No. <laughs> Did you really think that's where it was gonna go? What would that have ever done where you that was just <laughs> She just stuck the bracket against a random spot on the wall, like just to do nothing. Turn your head like out of the way and just scoot forward more. Yeah, and just get out of the way so I can. Oh boy. All right, don't, don't move. You won't feel a thing. I'll try to be quick. That's it. Well, I can do the rest now. Turn that bank and tank down, don't bang it. Ding, drink a no bang and a bang and tank the ding and earn a bang and tank the bang a burner. All right, Brandon, we need to go grocery shopping. So we stopped eating at Taco Bell because that was nasty. It was delicious, okay? But like, it's nasty all the time. But we need to take a mental image of the fridge. Oh yeah, let's do that. Because I'm we're- I'm used to filling up my fridge. I know the size of my fridge. Now I gotta relearn a new, smaller fridge. Exactly, so this is what we got. We're opening it all together. You ready? Dun, 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 dun. How do you do it? Bah, 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 bah. You know what that is. <laughs> he was so kind and brought- Oh! oh! <laughs> what happened to my egg? Did it, did it freeze? I think so. Is that normal in your fridge? Can you open it? <laughs> um, <laughs> oh god, it's frozen. What? Why did it freeze? Are the other ones good? I don't know. That oh, one's no. cracked. Oh. Wait, so this needs, oh, it's pretty high up. My bad. <laughs> All right, let's go. God. I don't know how to stop this. I couldn't find a basket. I found but a mini cart. It's that compromise. It's not a full size cart, so we don't get too much mini cart. I just want to say, Brandon's a really fast shopper. He won't even give me a second to think. He's just like, okay, let's go. I hate being in grocery stores. I try to get in and get out. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Like, can I just. Wraps, wraps, wraps. See what I mean? It's all we ever need in life is wraps. Take all your food, push it up, put it in a wrap. Oh. Not every day has to be exciting here in van life. I mean, every day is exciting though. What was the most exciting part about today? You fixed my butcher block. You got the swivel seat installed for me. We're vlogging. That's always fun. That's always a good time. Yeah, we met some vlogging fans at Fred Meyer. He set up his GoPro at checkout and people got really excited and were just like, can I say hi? By the way, this guy, we should all congratulate him. He hit 400,000 subscribers recently. Woo! Pretty pumped on that. Yeah, we all are. Stinking 400,000 subscribers, this guy. Now let's get me there. Gotta say, I'm stinking stoked. <laughs> In the words of Sarah. I would wear a t-shirt that said stinking stoked on it. Yeah, I would too. Stinking stoked, <laughs> what was the other one? Dirt person. Dirt person. Stinking stoked, and... Someone said Toby Toes, they'd get a shirt that said Toby Toes on it. another one. Hello, my name is Brandon. This is us at the park. Jeez, that was aggressive. Is there a reason for that? I'm hungry. I need a snack. Eat the bag of chips behind you. Oh, yeah. While we're in the spirit of just yelling at each other a little bit. Yeah! <laughs> raising our voices at each other. Three day review. Are we on day three? I don't know. It feels like a freaking lifetime. We already had our first argument other than just now. Do you want to know what this argument was about, guys? Let me just, let me just tell you what this argument was about. I had in my head what the arguments would maybe be about that we would probably fight about? Uh, no, never would have guessed this one. She is mad that I didn't want to go to sleep at the same time and wake up at the same time because I was gonna let her go to sleep in her bed and I was gonna sit up front, edit my YouTube videos, but that was unacceptable. 
in Sarah's world. You know why? You he must... doesn't have headphones. You think I'm gonna sit up there and be loud the whole time? I would've taken your headphones. I'm not letting you put my AirPods in your ears. I clean my ears Gross. like once a month. I clean my ears never. Ew. What do you mean, ew? But I probably have the healthiest ears out of everyone here because I that's don't put shit in it. Healthy ears means you have a lot of earwax, so that's still- Oh, wait a minute. Though. I mean, I do kind of clean it. I when, I, I when I go in the shower, I let the water go into it. Q-tips are not good for you. Let me see. Let me look in your freaking ears. <laughs> okay, I, argument you, number three. You can probably shake your ears and little crumbs will fall out. <laughs> okay, anyway, back to the original argument. Yeah. Whether I'm sleepy or not, like normally I edit all my videos at night until I can't stay awake any longer. She's like, no, Brandon, it's- 9, 9 p.m. We must go to sleep now. It was midnight. We must get our full 12 hours of sleep. It was midnight. And we will wake up when I say we wake up. And you will not touch your computer <laughs> until I allow you to touch your computer. And I was like, Sarah, I think that's a little bit unreasonable. Can we talk about this in a, in a calm manner? And she's like, no. And I was like, Sarah, like, I didn't know it was going to be like this. I apologize. I'm trying to come off in a nice way. And I was like, wow. Didn't know it was gonna be like this. But let me ask you one thing, Brandon. Let's yeah. say all that happened and we I did think. go to bed like that early. What did you say this morning when I you said, woke up? Good morning. It's a beautiful day. Let's get Wh the day started. What and did no 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 no? Sarah said, what you know did what? you Why say? Don't we sleep for four more what hours? did you say? I I, well, I I don't know what I said. You, you said just... that was the best night's sleep I've ever had. Oh, not ever no, had. No, 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 best no, night's sleep I've had in a while. Oh. Am I going where am I? Are you turning? You're taking a, a Brandon. It, okay, because the last two nights I didn't get much sleep. Exactly. We need to be on the same schedule. <laughs> we still have to drive 18 hours together. I don't know how this is going to work. I'm probably going to chuck this camera at him right now because he's making me car sick. Oh, my, Brandon! <laughs> if I turn my bars, maybe. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. I can't really do much of it. <laughs> oh, I'm kind of stuck. <laughs> Everyone should go watch his vlogs in sl oh, half slow-mo. <laughs> a little bit past this part. I <laughs> don't know what else to do. <laughs> Pushing it backwards going to be so hard. All right, we need to do yours now. Put one of yours <laughs> <laughs> Some of my friends are already oh, sorry. It was up. right there. I knew, I knew you were gonna miss the turn. I knew it. Turn here, turn here. Piled up since I ran out of water. The last <laughs> desert spot I was at. <laughs> so oh, drunk. Uh huh. Okay, so I got a little hungry. You sound I hammered. Have some luck. Hey, buddy. Hey, <laughs> buddy. <laughs> Hey, buddy. To be honest with you guys, I'm like kind of intentionally just starting fights with him so that he just doesn't hang out with me anymore. I don't want to hang out with him See, anymore. I'm too pleasant and nice of a human that even when you try to start fights with me, I just take it and appreciate you just being here and helping me out, you know? Scoot over, Brandon. We need to show the world what we're dealing with. This is mine. This is mine. Shoes out of here. Uh, out of here. I'll just clean up. You go play with the dog. Hello? You okay? Just waiting for my spot to put all my belongings in the van. All this is you too, by the way. What? <laughs> this is me. That is, this is all you in here. Okay, but this plate is you too. That's not me. I didn't use a plate, you I used I don't even a plate. have plates like that. You are the one that used the plate yesterday. It's your plate. <laughs> are you ready to go? You ready to get back in the van? <laughs> Brandon is so bad at closing doors. Come on, Sarah, come on! Oh, uh, it's a full house now. <laughs> Let's see how Brandon does with a dog. I a love Toby. Dog. We're gonna be vibing and you're gonna be the one I'm stressed out. Is that true? 
Oh, okay, all right. The Toby Toes has spoken. Did I have sunglasses when I showed up? Oh, there's a bunch right here if you need any. Yeah, but they were Kyle's sunglasses and I wanted to give them back to him. Well, that sucks. Sorry, Kyle. You heard it here. He lost them. No, <laughs> maybe they're in my van. Toby's here. Toby! There oh. we go. Yeah, nice little lap dog. This is it. This is the <laughs> life right here. Toby, we're filming here. Just <laughs> wanna be the star of the show, huh? <laughs> He's like, why did you guys call me up here? No! Oh, oh, no! Okay, I'm gonna stop the vlog now so he can uh, no. survive another day. <laughs> Make sure you stick around to the next video so you can see if we survive. And I'll be honest, if we end up out of this not friends, I'll let you know. You guys will know. We're not gonna be in each other's videos anymore. That'll probably be how you know. No, 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 I'll do it. No, the neighbors are watching. The neighbors are watching. It's just a pimple. Yeah, but they're neighbors. So what? That's weird. I want to do it. Get, get. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Hit that notification bell. Subscribe, like, drop a comment for the YouTube algorithm. For both our channels. Sarah would greatly appreciate it, but I would appreciate it a little bit more. Is it, oh, <laughs> Is it be a part that was of my it? thing. <laughs> no, get off. <laughs> Turn a bank and tank down no badge and ding drink a no burn and a bank and tank the ding and a banjo tank the pain of burner.